entire facility is 404,000 square feet. Uh, the auto store itself is 60,000 square feet. There's 320 robots, uh, 92,000 bins. This solution has 34 relay ports, 19 conveyor ports, and six carousel ports. Marisa's is a, is a women's apparel retailer that offers a range of fashion products uh, to women. They needed someone to run their warehouse operations to fulfill their orders, their customer orders, both to the stores and to the e-commerce side, the end user. Marisa's hired Geotis to create a solution to fulfill all of their orders and distribution. Geotis then hired Bastion to be their integrator, which integrated Manhattan, WMS, and AutoStore. So we chose Bastion Solutions because uh, of their experience with AutoStore primarily. Uh, we knew we needed a mature technology that could do um, a significant amount of throughput like this site does, and, um, and from someone who has a lot of experience with AutoStore, and Bastion fit that bill. The business case was to develop a true omni-channel solution that was flexible and scalable for the future. They needed a solution that was would work for multiple channels, that reduces dependency on labor, uh, that has the right amount of peak throughput to deliver a certain service level expectation during the holiday peak period. AutoStore is perfect for fashion retailers that have tremendous SKU depth that are always adding new SKUs with size, style, color, diversity that just results in thousands of different items that need to be fulfilled to many channels, whether that's stores, online orders, or everything in between. And the AutoStore does a perfect job kind of swallowing that inventory complexity and delivering just the right inventory to the ports when needed, uh, whether that's you know, putting the seasonal items out of the way in the bottom of the grid in the off season, or really pushing out new inventory to stores when that uh, has just come in from manufacturers to get that fast turnaround that consumers are expecting. So the system has 18 vertical auto baggers, which is ultimately a, a, a automated packaging equipment that aids the operator in packing e-commerce apparel orders in a more um, timely fashion. So it increases the productivity of the operator, ultimately helps us get the orders out the door faster and, and with less labor. One of the really powerful things we see people using with their auto source is picking store-friendly replenishments. And that means that you're picking out of your auto store system and your distribution center so that when it arrives to the store, it's ready for the store associates, not needing to be sorted again. And that saves even more labor in the supply chain. So right now, current volumes will put out anywhere from 120,000 units retail and 60,000 units e-commerce per day. Um, during peak periods, we can go up at, at a total of 225, 250,000 units a day. The system is designed to do a lot more than that if we need it. We were asked to develop a solution that we could implement in year one and then ramp up volume over the course of three to five to, to eight years and even beyond. And we felt that AutoStore was best positioned to be able to deliver on that. This solution uh, by design is able to support uh, the client's e-commerce business to grow up to 50% of where we stand today. This is one of the highest throughput auto stores we've ever built. What uh, the Geodis team did with Bastion here is really one of the most advanced fulfillment centers uh, that exists on earth. Upon deployment, this was the highest throughput auto store system in the world. Compared to other solutions, AutoStore uh, stood out, particularly for this site, it's, it's very high throughput. Um, and in order to do that with more traditional ASRSs, it's a lot of complex um, mechanics and controls and so on. And AutoStore can do that with uh, the same core modules and principles in terms of the, the robots, the bins, the ports, just more of them. Um, so it's not any more complex then a smaller site would be um, just a lot more of, of all of those components, and that's a lot different than you would find in traditional ASRS systems that would require far more motors and drives and controls components and a lot of mechanical complexity and maintenance and so on that would be associated. You know, we have ports from all the way at a manual end of the pickup port where customers can pick up orders in a store, all the way up to this high-end port that's behind me, the 650 bins per hour relay port. Uh, in the middle of that is our sweet spot uh, carousel port that's been used in a number of applications, direct to consumer e-commerce picking, store order picking when there's a little bit more work content. And then we have the fusion port and then the relay port is our fastest port. AutoStore's relay ports in this case were, were very important because they are the highest throughput pick port that AutoStore has to offer. And in this case, that was 
that was a that was a requirement. It ultimately keeps the bin transition time from one uh, inventory bin to the next down to the lowest possible um, amount of time, which uh, aids in efficiency, keeps the picking productivity up, allows us to achieve the throughput uh, that we need to. So here we are in the picking tunnel. We're underneath the auto store. Uh, Bastion Solutions has built a mezzanine to hold up a section of the auto store and robots can drive over the top and then drop down bins to the ports that you see behind me. Um, the picking tunnel both helps the robots because it decreases the travel distances that bins need to, to go, but it also helps to centralize the operations here where packaging material can be delivered, where takeaway conveyors and other MAT can be routed, and the whole operations team can work in one, one position. Uh, picking tunnel is also a way to get even more throughput out of an auto store because now you can put ports anywhere you need them, not just on the perimeter or on the ends of a typical aisle in an ASRS. We now can put ports at will anywhere on the grid. Another great aspect that the auto store brings to the table is the, just the reliability. Uh, granted, we do have downtime um, on some of the robots, but that does not affect productivity by any means. So we could have robots that go down or need to be charged or things like that. Um, but we have that flexed in so that other robots are still delivering the goods. Bastion integrated all the technology in the building, of which there's a lot. Um, there's uh, many miles of conveyor, automated packing equipment, robotic piece picking, uh, obviously auto store, um, and many others. Yeah, we work with Exacta day in, day out. That's what controls the auto store solution. So WM will talk to Exacta which then talks to the conveyance and controls the entire system. It's very easy to integrate an auto store with different kinds of upstream and downstream technologies. Of course, conveyors and full workspace designs are very specific to different customers' needs. And so for this site, for example, they have a specific design with relay ports and also allows us to easily feed downstream packout operations, whether that's a vertical auto bagger, manual uh, packaging, or some of the automatic packaging options that can fully close and, and even sort a box before it's been touched again by, by an operator. Bastion Solutions Smart Pick is a robotic arm that automatically picks items from the auto store bin into the customer order cart. So we have five Bastion Solutions smart pick stations in the system and we're looking to, to grow that um, over time. Robotic piece picking and uh, applications like the Bastion Solutions smart pick are perfect for an auto store because we can bring any bin to any port at any moment. And so the SKUs that are robot eligible as soon as you have a collection of orders in either the e-commerce channel or in the store channel that are fully robotic eligible, those orders can be routed to a particular station and then the bins are presented in a way that's actually ergonomic to the robot. So the workspace is designed for the robot to be able to retrieve and grasp those items and place them effectively in the order. So AutoStore has attracted talent from all levels here. Uh, the people love working with the robots, um, they, the technology, you know, the robots are doing the heavy lifting for them. So we can train and have, and have people ready, hitting their productivity, fulfilling the orders for the customer quickly. Or typically, you know, we'd look at something, it's probably four weeks to four weeks to six weeks to hit your target productivities. Uh, this is a week and a half, uh, which is a, a great advantage. So with AutoStore and, and the integrated solution by Bastion, we were able to achieve a reduction of approximately 30% in our operating com cost compared to other solutions that we considered. I would say in this case, automation has helped um, transform people's lives by making their jobs easier within the warehouse. Uh, for example, we've, we've automated portions of the, the picking process that uh, our typical operators don't want to do. That makes them want to come back to work uh, on a daily basis. So in this workstation, we're now bringing the goods straight over to the employee. And uh, with that, we've eliminated all the walking and searching time, which for a large warehouse like this one, that could be eight to 12 miles of travel in a day. And we've now automated that with the robots and the people can now focus on the important things for Maurice's, which is filling orders, um, getting the right inventory into the right orders and making sure we have really high order quality. I think people like working with technology and, and uh, technology like AutoStore and um, it adds a certain level of job satisfaction to be able to work with robots and, um, and interface with technology on a day-to-day -day basis. And of course the practical benefits such as uh, reducing uh, the fatigue on their bodies and so forth. But I think also 
Um, you know, something that's often understated is just the excitement, the element of working with technology um, that's more on the leading edge um, is, is, is aids in job satisfaction for people.